2019, the Rafting Group took on many new challenges as one team, offering new value to society. Here, we look back over an eventful year. Rafting Optimism 2019 brought together businesses from across the group for the first edition of this event in Japan and the largest event in Rafting's history. Significantly disruptive. The second Rafting Optimism in the US was also bigger and better, showing Rafting's growing presence in the Americas region. Ragdon Mobile established the world's first end-to-end -end fully virtualized cloud-native network and launched its new mobile operator service. Cloud-native architecture. Antennas were rapidly deployed and tests were conducted in various locations as the Ragdon Group took on the challenge of becoming Japan's newest mobile carrier. Fans around the world also saw the Rakuten brand on display of many thrilling moments thanks to our partnerships. And we also spread a message of empowerment alongside brand awareness through new and strengthened alliances. What's more, new initiatives were launched in the wider entertainment industry. The use of big data and AI in technology is accelerating, and collaboration with partners around the world has enabled us to solve very complex issues. It itself represents our passion for the technology. Development efficiency. A new office opened in Dalian as Rakuten's tech hub in China, while Rakuten India is expanding its scale and technological capabilities as Rakuten's global innovation center. Elsewhere, the first CTO summit, especially for the Americas region, took place in San Mateo. Rakuten also launched its first commercial delivery service using unmanned delivery robots on land and in the air. The Rakuten ecosystem continued to expand across Japan and the world. There was a rapid increase in the number of stores accepting Rakuten Pay and Rakuten Super Points, and we have plans to extend coverage of the Rakuten Express delivery service to 60% of the Japanese population. The Rakuten ecosystem in Taiwan expanded through an alliance with local e-commerce leader PC Home. Meanwhile, Rakuten TV tripled its service coverage in Europe, while Rakuten Kobo also expanded its regional presence through partnerships and companies including Rakuten France and Rakuten Germany continue to promote the ecosystem through large-scale events. Rakuten Card opened the second Rakuten Card Lounge in Hawaii and established Rakuten Bank America, which is currently applying for a bank license in the United States. Various Rakuten offices also saw results in QCC, our bottom-up quality and productivity improvement program as this initiative spread from Japan to Taiwan and France. We announced Rakuten Fashion, a new strategy to empower the fashion industry in Japan, while Rakuten became the main sponsor for Tokyo Fashion Week. Our fintech businesses, centered around Rakuten Pay, teamed up with the Rakuten Eagles and Vissel Kobe to launch the Cashless Stadium initiative. Rakuten Insurance Planning also unified different customer contact points to enhance customer service, creating the Rakuten Insurance General Information Center. The number of Rakuten cardholders, as well as Rakuten Bank and Rakuten Securities accounts, rose at a rapid rate, and there was a dramatic increase in cross-usage of fintech services.
many services marked important milestones in 2019. Meanwhile, in Rectum Medical, the final stage of clinical trials for Rectum Medical's first investigational therapy, based on its proprietary Luminox, are underway. It was a landmark year for Rectin in the Americas, as Ebates officially rebranded to Rectin. Meanwhile, Aldra Head Pioneer Curbside became Rectin Ready. Rectin also created a new corporate slogan, Walk Together. Based on stronger bonds of trust, Rectin will walk together with everyone we share our society and businesses with and work alongside. Watch this space as Rectin continues to innovate around the world in 2020.